except we finally start constructing a framework for a scenario. Okay, there are several different ways you can do it. You can use the top two uncertainties. You can also do what's called extreme worlds, where you take all the uncertainties that are extreme for good or bad and group them together and construct them that way. People really get excited about doomsday scenarios, so sometimes that is a good way to go. Or you can do uh, clustering. You can do it other ways. I recommend using what's called the top two uncertainties approach. The way we will do that is we will use a two-dimensional matrix. So remember, you rank the uncertainties, which one had the greatest impact on the focus question. So now you're going to take the top two uncertainties that had impact on the focus question of those you identified, and you know that you have uncertain outcomes. So here's the first uncertainty, and one of the outcomes here, and then the same uncertainty and the other outcome. And then on this side, you have the second highest uncertainty with its two possible outcomes. And then you simply look at the interaction of those, of those two. So uncertainty one with that outcome, with uncertainty number two with this outcome, gives you a scenario theme. Okay, so now the possible outcomes are uh, troops will not leave and troops will leave, right? There's, yes. Okay, so there's your, your possible outcomes okay. for your matrix. One and two. And then this one is, um, so st stable political landscape, so stable, unstable would yes. be the two there. So there's your, your four Oops, points okay. on your matrix. This is the four points. Now when you name the box, exactly. make it interesting. Sustainable development. Sustainable development. <laughs> Sustainable development. So for the focus question, it will be important. The idea is you want to create a language which is shorthand for what that scenario is going to be. So when you're done, you're going to have a text description that tells a story of a plausible future world. And you want it to have a title that gets people's attention, makes them want to read it, and becomes shorthand for a reference to that whole scenario.